All right, y'all, so this is what I have so far. I keep running out of wallpaper, so I gotta order some more wallpaper so I can finish this little area right here. And then all the uneven parts that y'all see right here is gonna be like a little wood panel or something across. So that's why I didn't even it out because I don't wanna do that until I get the wood piece to paint it. But this came along really nice. I just gotta um, get that last little section right there. So we can go ahead and finish this wall and get these girls' room, get this girl's room going and organized and cleaned up. So y'all just stay tuned for that. Oh, so I'm finally done with the wall, the wallpaper part at least. Um, we got that done. So let me show y'all how it came out. Um, this is my first time doing any kind of wallpaper on the wall and um, Don't mind me y'all. I'm looking rough. It's project day, but anyway, it's my first time I think I did really pretty 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 good for, for it being a first time So let me just show you how it looks So this is how it looks. Hopefully y'all can see that. Um, don't mind this right here. And you know how it's like uneven. Let me move this ladder back. Don't mind how it's like uneven and stuff or whatever. Because like I said, we're gonna put a piece of trimming right here in the middle. Well, not the middle, but like further up here, we're gonna cut all the way across, like literally right under those right there. So all that unevenness y'all see, the wood is literally gonna cover all that up. So that's why I just did it like that. And it was easier for me to do it uneven than to try to get it so perfect and then it get wrinkled up. So yeah, we're gonna put the trimming across here and then let me get a close up. So. It's some few imperfections, but I mean, you can't really see it unless you close up. But like I said, I think I did pretty good on this wall with it being my first time and doing it alone. Like I didn't really uh, have to have Fred do too much. Like he kind of probably hold the wallpaper up on his last corner right here because, ooh, it was a struggle y'all with me being so short trying to reach over this big old ladder. But anyway, I, um, the trimming is gonna go across here and then we're gonna paint the, the remaining, the remaining. And um, like I said, this is how, let me go back. This is how it looks right now, the room, the girls' room. Like I said, we've been here a little over a year, maybe like a year in, what's this, August, two months almost. So I'm gonna be removing this. We're gonna remove all this, put new, um, curtains we're going to be touching up the wall over here because we were going to put some stuff over here if you can see I don't know if y'all can see that right there um, we're going to be changing out the bedding eventually they're going to get new new beds but we working on that and then and then I got um, we have the TV on this wall and that's just you know the camera or whatever because my kids is they the most and then you know we got whatever anyway y'all know if you got kids you know you know but anyway um all this here i'm not liking and so we're gonna do moving the tv on this wall here but yeah that's how it came out so as we go along we're gonna um Hopefully we get to finish this wall and close this video out. And then this is gonna be like a little series or whatever. Like I said. Uh -oh. This is how it looks. We decide to use screws. And we're just gonna do the little paste over it. I'm gonna cut this out. The excess gonna come off before I start painting and put the um, stuff on there. And we have a small right here, but you can always fix that. So yeah, I already uh, we already got the excess peeled off at the bottom. So now 
we will be um right now we'll be putting some some sealant to make it look more you know flushed in with the wall and um you see right here i had to add another piece because I, I came up short i ain't gonna lie i came up short so i basically cut another piece and add it right here so i'm gonna flush all that in and i'm gonna shave the um these uh screws i'm gonna shave them so they can be flush and i got some stuff to go over them that's pretty much how far we got. So y'all, as you can see, I see all the cracks. So it look flush. Got the molding all the way down the board. So it's still kind of wet. So I'm waiting on it to dry. But my next step will be to sand the screws. So it can be flush in with the board and I'm gonna go over it with some, some putting and then I'm gonna paint and you will see the final touch. So y'all, this is day five doing this project, man. Um, I ran into a mistake. I realized I did something wrong, so I am correcting it. And this is the proper way to do it. Um, as you can see, See these screws I was showing y'all um, the other day. So what I want to do, cause I don't want to paint over them. It's not really flush. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to take every last screw out and I'm going to go and drill, take my drill bit and um, I'm going to drill a little deeper so it can be inside and I'm going to put some putting over it so you can't see. It's going to look real good, man. So. Let's get right into it. So I am finished with, with this step. So all I got to do is go over it with the sand, make it look smooth, and we are good. So the next thing I'm about to work on, because this I got to let this dry and stuff. So um, I will be doing my daughter's TV. So right now we got uh, got it on this side of the wall. So I will be putting it over there. So I see y'all in a few. Now, before I even hang the TV up, I decided I'm gonna put some LED lights on my daughter's TV. So um, first thing first, you wanna make sure they plug right on up. As, as you can see, all the lights are working. So it's time to get to work. Um, I am installing a camera in my girl's room because they do not get along and I can spy and make sure they doing what they're supposed to be doing. So yeah, this is the final touch as you can see. Got the TV on the wall, got the lights on the wall. So my daughters, they can have them a nice night light. Um, now for over here, the wall, the only thing left is the paint. So I will be prepping up, taping the, uh, the borderline so I can start painting. And I told you I already sand. So you can't even tell like once I go over the paint, you ain't gonna be able to see the the, uh, the nails. So y'all, it is done. I just got to finish taping the uh, outlines and stuff. So it's ready to paint. But the bad news is we are not gonna be able to finish it today. So yes, it will be day six tomorrow. We should have everything you know up and steady but i'm gonna show you how it look um you can see everything is good this is what it, everything is getting paint inside that that blue line i cannot wait to show y'all the outcome um but i appreciate y'all man for tuning in to our channel man you know we we knew we knew that this tiktok stuff so um we gonna get y'all some stuff to to watch 
What's going on, y'all? It is day six, I believe. I don't know. But it is painting day, and this should close it out. So, gonna get right on to it. So, y'all, this is the final touch. So y'all, if y'all like this video, please like it and hit the follow, subscribe button, whatever you want to call it. Um, until then, man, you will see more videos like this. Also, we got cooking videos as well, so we're going to be switching it up on here. I'll see y'all later.